Information available to the news team indicates that the illegality by some Nigerians and Togolese has gone on for some 18 years. Communities in Togo, mostly dominated by Nigerians, engage in the practice. As at 2017, there were over 30 Ghanaian curriculum schools in Togo that enrolled Nigerian citizens. They include Wisdom International School, Light of the World International School, Trinity Gems, Divine Knowledge, Holy Child, and Sylvia Modern Academy. These schools are affiliated to some eight private schools based in the K2 South municipality, with some of the Ghanaian schools affiliated to more than three of the Togolese schools. The eight schools in the K2 South municipality include Kekeli Complex School, Assemblies of God Experimental School, Freedom International School, and ECOWAS International School. The investigation was triggered by the campaign promise of the then presidential candidate Nana Ekufuado to introduce free senior high school education from September 2017. The team felt if such Ghanaian curriculum running schools in Togo with foreign students were allowed to continue with their affiliation with schools based in the Ketu South Municipal to write the BEC, it will mean enrolling and educating foreign students with Ghana's resources and hence increasing government expenditure. Statistically, these schools have an average of 35 pupils per school that usually sit for the basic education certificate examination in the Ketu South Municipal. Once these foreign pupils sit for the BEC, they become eligible for the free SHS. 30 schools engaged in the illegality translate into 1,050 foreigners trooping to Ghana to enjoy free senior high education. Some have been duly placed by the Computerized School Selection Placement CSSPS as far back as 2016. What is more worrying is that these illegal businesses have taken a new twist following the ability of two of the schools in Togo, Sylvia Modern Academy and Sylvia Royal Montessori, owned by the same proprietress named Madame Enenna Samuel, had gotten her schools established in Togo registered under the Ghana Education Service. The school has been provided an index number whereby the name of her school in Togo appear on the basic education certificate examination of her past students. Having done all this, she has succeeded in mobilizing other schools in Togo to do same by devoting to help them acquire examination center numbers and currently advertising her plans to other school owners at a cost. Consequently, the structures and populations of these schools are good indicators that such schools in Togo and Nigerian students have prosperous future as far as their affiliation with Ghanaian schools in the Ketu South and beyond are concerned. Even though it is a requirement under the Education Act 2008, Act 778, for all basic schools to be recognized by the Ministry of Education, the Ministry could not readily confirm or deny that the 28 schools are on their list.